Hello everybody watching, this is uh, Money Collector 2022 and uh, today we're going to be comparing a 1990 $100 bill to a 1993 $100 bill. We're going to be going over some of the cool features of each of these and uh, before I get started, I want to thank you guys for 2,000 subscribers. Uh, I believe the day I'm making this video I have to, over 2,050 subscribers. Uh, yeah, I've been uh, meaning to make a video but uh, i just been busy and uh, yeah, I'm going to try to get back into making some videos again, so I hope you guys are excited for that. Uh, be on the lookout for some uh, money hunts and uh, some cool stuff. So, uh, yeah. So, this 1990, I found this one over the summer. Uh, I believe I uh, filmed that video doing a uh, money hunt. So, uh, make sure you guys check that video out if you haven't already. So, uh, yeah, there shouldn't be too many uh, big design changes. Now, the uh, 1993 compared to the uh, 1990 sax, I might even do another video on that. I might have did a video on that already. I'm not sure. But uh, that's a big design change between that time, between the 1993 and 1990 sax. All right, so the 1990, this is uh, B2, so uh, New York. It says it right there. The, even the newer hundreds will say the uh, B2 or... A1, they just won't say what it is. You have to Google it or learn it. <laughs> but uh, yeah, the older ones are uh, very uh, classic. Uh, they say they look like Monopoly money, but uh, at the time when Monopoly was uh, the game, when it like, was coming out or whatever, this is what money would look like. So uh, yeah, it's kind of funny to think about. So uh, yeah, it says Federal Reserve Note. Uh, the 1993 is A1, Boston, Massachusetts. Uh, it's a Federal Reserve note, Federal Reserve note, uh, United States of America, United States of America. I found this one probably, I think I found this back in uh, 2022, somewhere around there, if I, if I can remember right. But uh, yeah, both of these are going to have the anti-counterfeiting uh, strip, or whatever you want to call it. In the bill, you can actually see it. I'm going to zoom in a little bit. Right there. And then right there. Um, that one has a little mark on it. But uh, yeah, if you find anything, let's say a small head uh, note, I highly recommend holding on to it if you can. And the cool thing is, if you find one, hold on to it if you can. Then if you find something that is better, if you find one that's like better you can always swap them out it's always a cool trick all right so we kind of went over the front of both of these so now we're going to flip them around here the backs are probably uh identical <laughs> we're gonna uh, take a look here so the 1990 the oldest oldest one uh, it says in god we trust and then the united states of america in god we trust and then hundred dollar bill and it has the uh, very cool sideways hundred. Very, very cool. And then it has the Independence Hall, which uh, looks different than the newer bills. And, and then something to do with the clock is at a different time on the newer bills too, I believe. But I'm not 100% sure. So I believe the clock is at the same time on these bills, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong. So it looks like 1.30, I want to say. And the same for that one. So uh, yeah, I think the back of these are pretty much identical. So not, not too much big design changes here. So, uh, yeah, you can see the anti-counterfeiting strip to the left, and uh, you can see it on that one, too. So, uh, yeah, not too much big design changes uh, on these bills, but, uh, yeah, very cool. Uh, let me, guys, you guys have to let me know in the uh, comments if you guys uh, see any of these uh, too often. And uh, yeah, if you guys like this video, make sure you guys like and subscribe. It uh, helps the uh, channel. 
And uh, yeah, thanks again for uh, 2,000 subscribers and uh, look out for some more videos. Thanks for watching.